I'm Lexi. And I'm Jenna. And today we are going to be doing a fail or, or not. So we are going to make two slimes. One you are going to use glue and contact solution. And the other is going to be soap and you're going to freeze two to three minutes. minutes. Okay, let's get started. So, the first one I'm going to do is the soap one. So, the thing you'll need is soap, spoon, and a bowl. And the freezer. Yeah, of course. Okay. So, squirt the soap into the bowl. And it doesn't matter how much. Okay. So, we have our soap in the bowl. Now, we're just going to start stir mm -hmm. stirring, stirring it until you see bubbles. So it's starting to look like this. I don't know and if you should add more. And it is starting to become bubbly. We're kind of wondering if we should add a little more soap or not. We're just gonna add some more because it doesn't look like it has any. Okay, so we're just going to stir this one. So I think this one is going to work and not be a fail. What do you think? Um, I think it's going to be a fail because I've done a lot of soap ones and it doesn't really work for me, but you know, it might work. Okay, so now that we have this all bubbly, we are going to put it in the freezer, freezer and wait for two, two to three minutes. minutes. So while we're waiting, for the first slime we got done. We're gonna do the second one. So for this, the ingredients you'll be needing are glue, contact solution, a bowl, and this one. Boom. So we have our bowl, and now we we'll pour our glue into the bowl. Mm -hmm. Is that enough, you think? Mm, a little bit more. We're just doing a little bit because we don't know if it will work. Okay. Now we're going to take our contact, contact lens solution. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and put it into the bowl of the glue. So now we we'll are going mix to it. mix. I think it's going to be a fail. And I think it's going to be... Yeah, I think it might be a fail. Because it's just looking sticky, gross, and gluey. So we're going to keep on mixing to see if it works. While we're mixing, we're going to see if the second one works or not. And to see our results, we are going to mix and see. This is actually, it looks like it's working, but it looks like it might be a little bit sticky. Yeah, so it looks like it might work. So we're going to put it in our hands to see if it works. We want to put it in our hand. Uh, yeah. Um, this is not slime. This feels like gelatin or something. It is super sticky and it gets all over your hands. This is a fail. Well, I guess it would it technically be a fail depending on what you wanted your slime to be like. If you wanted your slime to be slimy slime or slime that sticks together. If you want your slime to be slimy slime, this might be good, but but what we were trying to make, this is a fail. Yep. Okay, so now I'm going back to the first slime. So we're just going to keep on stirring this and adding more of this. To yeah. Yeah. Because it's looking pretty sticky and gross. Okay, so we're going to keep on stirring this. 
And wait to see. So this is what it's looking like so far. I'm kind of sticky and thinking like a fail. Yeah, it kind of seems like the first one, but I'm not sure. Okay, this looks like a fail, but we're just going to put it on my hands to see if it works or not. <laughs> oh okay. So, I'm going to like, holy cow. Holy cow. Holy cow. Um. Um. Yeah. This is a total fail. You cannot do this without baking it soda. It. You need it with baking soda. If you don't, this does not work. Total fail. This is not a slime. I'm going to go wash my hands now. In disappointment. Okay, well, this was a total fail video for both slimes. Yep. So, you're welcome for giving you no tips, except for what ones not to use. Don't so. waste your products. Exactly. Have a nice day. And make sure to like and subscribe. Bye.